Welcome back, everybody. Taking a quick look at our current conditions. We got 84 degrees in San Angelo, 60% humidity with winds coming in from the south. A little breezy, about 14 miles an hour. Looking around the rest of the region, we do have low to mid 80s as we continue getting through the early morning hours. Humidity levels are a little bit higher, though, in the 50s, 60s, even the 70s as we continue getting through today. So it will feel very muggy as you head out the door these early morning hours. We do have clouds pushing in from the west across the region. A few spotty showers around Sterling City and Robert Lee at this time. And even just around Reagan County is starting to make their way in. But as they move more eastward, they continue to dissipate into the area. So we're not going to have a whole lot going on until later today. A few showers are up in the panhandle moving into Oklahoma and along the border to the north here. So for the rest of the state, not too much going on. Now we haven't had a lot of rain for much of the month. We've gone 26 days without rain. Our total is actually below average, so we're actually 0.34 inches below at this time. And that's why we're going to have a decent amount of drought for a majority of the region. Now, even though we only, we're less than half an inch under for the month, we're actually over two inches under since June first of this year. So that's why there's a lot of areas in the moderate and some areas even into the extreme drought. Breaking down our day planner, we're going to have a mix of sun and clouds as we go through the morning into the afternoon hours. Winds pretty steady from the south, 10 to 15 miles per hour. Highs are expected to be in the upper 90s into the triple digits, so 99 to 104 as we continue through our day. Now we will have some of those showers very lightly in some areas and then as we get into tomorrow afternoon, start to see some showers and storms develop in much of the Contra Valley region and even getting into Wednesday, there's a slight chance of showers in the morning. Moisture will kind of increase as we get into Wednesday morning. Tonight, we are dropping to 78 degrees for a low with spotty showers. Tomorrow, 101 expected for a high. And then breaking down a seven-day forecast, we'll be done with the triple digits for a while as we after we're done with Tuesday and heading into the week. Next weekend, we'll be down into the low 90s.